Hey everyone, this is Mary. I go by Beer Money on eBay, YouTube, and TikTok. And this is my first haul video, so be a little patient with me as I worked out some bugs. Um, I hope you enjoy it. Let me know if you'd like to see more of these. Let's get into it. My first stop was at this Goodwill. All of these stores are about five miles from my house. The second stop was a hospice thrift store, and the final stop was another Goodwill. So let's see what we got. I've been off a couple days this week and each day I went thrifting. So this is Wednesday's haul and I'm gonna do a video for each of the three days that I went. Show you guys what I got, how much it cost and what I think I'll make. So first up is this Part Angora Bejeweled Sugar Lips New With Tags Cropped Women's Sweater. Usually don't pick up women's, but it was Angora and it was $4.50, so I thought I'd give it a shot. Um, then I got this. I don't usually do a lot of hats either. I'm just, I'm trying new stuff. So this is a New York Yankees American flag logo fitted MLB uh, hat. It was $2.99, but I get 25% off all my stuff at Goodwill because we have this little club that I'll tell you about or I've already told you about, so. Uh, then I got a pair of Ugg boots, black, just standard, the standard Ugg boot, nothing fancy. They were $9.99 with 25% off, so $7.50-ish. Um, this is one of my bread and butters. This is a Tommy Bahama 100% silk men's Hawaiian camp shirt. Got it backwards, sorry. $4.50, I'll sell it for $15 to $20 um, plus shipping, so nothing stupendous but uh i'll take it it'll sell fast because it's a good pattern then this is um same thing another bread and butter foot joy this is red white and blue so i thought it was pretty cool striped um it does have a club logo sometimes that can lower the price but it's a it's a really nice polo it's a lot it's an extra large i need my glasses um so again 450 probably sell for 15 to 17 plus shipping. This is um, Pole and Shark. It's a pretty good brand. It's new to me, so I've been trying it out with different styles. It's a men's pink polo. Should probably get like maybe 20, 25 plus shipping. All right, this is a Nike Pro. This isn't a unique Nike Pro because it's like baseball themed. It's gray stripes. It's got the swoosh. The swoosh has a little cracking in it, but that's okay. Uh, authentic MLB. It's super soft. Um, size large. So not expecting too much out of this. Maybe fourteen dollars for shipping. Sorry, I'm having some lighting issues. This is a Glen Lion made in Scotland, one hundred percent cashmere men's black V-neck. I don't think you can see it. Um, sweater. I always pick up 100% cashmere no matter what it is. It always sells well. This is a Thomas Pink polo. I might just keep this for myself. I don't think it's going to... If I put it up, I don't think it would sell for much. But So that might be just personal use. These were new to me. These are Sperry's. I've never seen Sperry sandals, like men's clunky sandals. So we're going to give them a shot. Probably thinking 20 plus shipping. They were $7.50. Maybe a little more. I don't know. I'll put them a little high. Drop it down in a minute to see. These were really hard to decipher what they are. I'm sure sneakerheads out there know what they are. They're not like a home run because there's some definite wear on the bottom, but there's still plenty of life. I don't think that's going to... It might lower the price, but I don't think it's going to be a deal breaker for someone. The air bubbles all work. They're Nike, LeBron. 15, I think. Yeah, is that how you do it? Um, yeah, oh, well, there you go. 15, if you can see that. Um, the tag is deep in there. And at the thrift store, I was trying to shove my phone down there. It was crazy hard. Um, but I was able to find them. I think they're called Oreo colorway? I'm not sure. But they were... $14.99 um, and then 25% off that. So 
What's that, like 11.50? I think I'll at least double or triple my money. We'll see how those how those do. Stay tuned. Um, that's not from there. This is another one I'm just giving a shot at. It's a Cannondale Made in USA fanny pack for those cyclists out there. Cannondale's a cycling brand. Um, it was only $4.99. So, what is that? $3.50 ish. It's got water bottle spots. I think at least double or triple my money on that guy. Then these were pretty interesting. These are women's Air Force Ones. Look at that colorway. And they've got a couple spots that I can, I can, I'll be able to get those out. They're really nice. They, the bottoms almost seem, except for that one random rock, seem, <laughs> they haven't been used a whole lot. They are missing their insoles, but that's not a deal breaker either. These are women's uh, size 11 and a half. So that's a bigger women's size, but um, again, I think these were, well, these were $14.99, so these are eleven fifty, um, ish. We'll give them a shot. I think this week has been all about trying something new, getting in my comfort zone. Um, definitely women's and I do shoes. I just don't do sneakers a lot. Like I'm probably more comfortable with these Sanitas, these little gray clogs. These are pretty cool looking. Uh, they've got a nice like patent leather. They're Koi Sanita, which I've never seen before. Women's, um, should I have my glasses on for this? I can't see the size. Oh, 38. Those were $7.50. Um, after the discount, they were $9.99, then 25% off. These were just some cool vans. Vans are hit and miss for me. Again, these are $9.99 into $7.50. They have cherries on them, which is pretty cool. They're like really good condition. Uh, see what size if I can see what the size is uh seven seven men's eight and a half women so it's a pretty good size figure maybe 2025 on these and then I think that's it for Goodwill and I also went to a VNA hospice thrift store where I got these Van Fibian Van Fibian men's board shorts they're like a hybrid short Really nice feel to them. They were five bucks. Probably get 15 or 20 out of these. Then these need a little bit of suede cleaning. The Tula, which is, I don't know if you can see that. I think so. The Tula, which is, um, maybe you can see it there better. The lighting in here stinks. I gotta fix my lighting. Uh, it's a Birkenstark, Birkenstark, Birkenstock <laughs> brand. They have a lot of good tread left. Very unique design, I think. Um, I'm not sure what these will go for. I have to look them up. But anything Birkenstock, I'll pick up because that usually sells. Same thing with this brand. This is Patagonia. This is just a men's um, button down, but it's got the organic cotton. I think it's a size large. It's a nice... Got a great feel to it, um, but I'll pick up any Patagonia as long as it's not like outrageously priced. And this was orange tag was half off, so this was two fifty. So that's awesome. Good. All right, so that's Tuesday's haul. Um, hopefully, you will see all of this stuff in a what sold video very soon. Thank you guys so much for watching. Please like, comment, subscribe, and happy selling.